I am recording a video about uh, me making a baby changing table for our baby that is coming. We're not sure if it's a boy or a girl yet, uh, but we do find out in just a few weeks. Today is January 10th, 2018, and uh, we get to find out in a few weeks if it's going to be a boy or a girl. Um, but I was looking online and I found these really cool um, drawings and um, templates for making your own baby changing table and I thought it'd be really cool for me to give it a try. So uh, I'm just going to make a quick video of me doing that and kind of the steps and processes going into that um, and we'll see how it turns out. It's supposed to look something like this. I don't know if you could see that. It's supposed to look something like that when it's completed. Uh, but we'll see. I'll give it a try and see how things go. So I've already pre-cut all my wood here. Hopefully I've cut it to the right measurements. We'll see. Oliver went with me to Lowe's, didn't you bud? Did you go with me to Lowe's? So I am on night number two of working on this changing table. What I completed yesterday uh, was one of the sides. So I made a cool little X here on one side and it seems to be sturdy. And I'm working on the second X. I got one diagonal and I'm going to come in with another X. So these are going to be the two sides and then I'm going to work on sanding these and then start to put together a couple of the table tops. So here I am cutting the wood, screwing it together, and what is my favorite dog doing to help? What are you doing to help, bud? Huh? Are you just chewing on a piece of wood? How is that helping for the little baby? Huh? How? I don't think it is. Oh, okay, you're a big mean dog. Yeah. So today is day three of working on the changing table. Uh, like I said before, I'm in no rush. Um, ideally, if you really wanted to get this done pretty quickly, I, I could have gotten it done probably in a couple days, but I'm gonna space this out over some time. But what I did get completed last night is the top of the table, and it looks like this. So this is gonna be the top of the table. Um, it's pretty sturdy and heavy, so I can only imagine when everything's done uh, how heavy all of that will be. But this is going to be the top here where the little baby gets its diaper changed. And a bonus, Lisa and I agreed that if I make the changing table, then I don't have to change any diapers. Um, so that's what we agreed upon. Maybe I just agreed that to myself, but... Um, We'll see how, we'll see what she says about that. So this is almost the finished product. It's pretty much all put together. I've got the two shelves on the bottom. I made the little box here. 
so here is the finished product. Took me some time to make the changing table, but it came out pretty well, I think. Made sure to sand it down really well so there's no splinters or anything for the little baby. Stained it, which was not my most favorite part, but looks better. And then here's a look from the side. So it was a fun little project. Um, you know, once the baby no longer needs a changing table, this can unscrew pretty easily. And then it's just like a normal table. So hopefully it's something we can keep around for a while into the future. And we got this little thing to match as well. So I think it matches well together. So there you go. Baby changing table.